today, and today we're going to have a game of Crack Up on the Amstrad CPC, and this is a game recommendation from Rob Small on YouTube, right, so this is a breakout type clone sort of thing, well, I'll say a clone, it's quite like breakout if anything, I've never played this back in the day, let's give it a go. Now I'm using sort of joystick keyboard controls because I don't know the keys themselves and this would be a game that I'd much rather use keyboard on. Right. Oh! Yeah, so this is very, very basic for an Amstrad CPC. So basic sound effects. Oh, oh you do get power-ups though. So I've got a back extension there. Oh, oh, so that's catch. So it does, oh, so dual balls. So basic looking, but you do get the, um, the power-ups. It does look like something from the Atari 2600. Oh! So that takes me to the next level. Ah, now we're getting to more, um, something a little bit more different and then they're going to be quite difficult to get hold of actually oh and it goes in that one okay oh what come on so I don't know if you're going to get lasers in this one yes that's two so it's just four in total in this level to get because you can't get these white ones Oh god. Oh! Oh fuck it! So the good thing is you don't have to reset the level. Restart the level so you carry on where you're playing. I think it was mainly all like this anyway. Every majority of um, breakout clones I've clo played you never have to restart. I do like this, um, these type of games, these breakout type games. Ah, oh, fuck it. Ah, oh, come on. Ah! Oh! Shit. Oh, come on. So why is that last one's going to be a bastard? Come on. No, it's not going to get in there, is it? Of course it isn't. Oh, fucking hell. Come on, go on. Oh, you bastard. Ah, oh, I weren't over in time. Right, oh, okay. So you can play two players on this. I don't know if that's simultaneously, but that'd be quite interesting if it was. Came out in 89. Cool, that's a bit basic for 89, but it would have been a budget title, being Atlantis Software. I think if I had this back in the day, I would have enjoyed it. Oh. Get a fair amount of life, well, five lives in total, I think. So that's a C, that's a catch. Oh, oh, I'll get lasers. Oh, you do get lasers in this. Oh, whatever that X was. Don't know what the ah, fuck it. I should have should have kept hold of my lasers. So you do get all your power ups in this then. Oh, 
Yeah, as I say, graphically, it looks something from an Atari 2600. But when you're playing these breakout, breakout game, breakout clone games, well, you're not going to be graphically impressed anyway. It's just a bunch of blocks. Well, it's nice and colourful. I mean, the game's pretty responsive. Oh. Oh, that X gives you an extra life. Oh, right, okay. So that's nice, you can get extra lives. Oh, now the fucking ball sped up. Look at that. Oh! Oh, that's a catch. Oh, no! I need that power up to get me off this level. No, I'm gonna have to do it brick by brick, can I? Ah, what? Ah, oh, fuck, it's too much of an angle. Oh, one more to get. I bet that's gonna be a bastard. Well, of course it is. Of course it's gonna be a bastard. It's the last block. And it's at too much of an angle. I need to get it more in the middle. Ah, you fuck. Right, so it's always going to be pushing it in this direction. In the um, sort of right. Yeah, of course it's going to be a bastard to get the last block, isn't it? Of course it is. Oh, is that enough? Ah, oh, you utter. F Ugh. Oh, come on, just get the... F oh, f Fuck's sake, come on. Oh, I need to get it more in the middle. I need to get it in the middle. No, I can't. What? I can't. I'm just bouncing it. Nah. Alright, maybe get it. No, I'm just getting it in the same area each time. Here we go. Oh, yes. Oh, it's this one again. Fuck it! What the fuck? I've just wasted two lives there. What a fucking... Ah, oh, bollocks. Right, I think we'll leave this one there. Um... Yeah, it's not bad actually. It's not bad for a breakout clone. Yep, I know the graphics are a bit um, basic. It does look like something ported straight from an Atari 2600. But the playability is pretty good. Yeah, I would say it's not the best breakout clone in the world. Um, to be honest with you, I'm much. if I was going to go to I'd probably go to Arkanoid or Arkanoid 2 or something like that. Um, but you know, it's not bad because this would have been a budget title. So it's not bad. Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, and goodbye.